Hello friends, Namaskar, and uh, I hope you all are fine and enjoying sister learning and learning material modeling, designing new materials. I, Dr. Mohanil Verma, from Computational Nano Anuk Research Laboratory, Department of Applied Physics, Sri Sankracharya Technical Campus, Bilai, Chhattisgarh, India. I welcome you all in this new lecture and uh, I'm not going to uh, give the introduction directly. I am sharing my screen and uh, uh, starting the contents as well as the explanation what I am going to uh, discuss today. So first of all, uh, let me share my screen. So today I am just uh, going to discuss on this phonon, phonon related studies. So when we you Google that uh, phonon dispersion curves, then you get uh, this type of uh, wonderful curves. And uh, when whenever you uh, study any first principle based uh, uh, papers, articles, review articles, then uh, uh, you can have such type of uh, good curves and uh, one uh, curves related to band and second one is uh, related to this uh, phonon dispersion curves. So in many articles you can obtain this. Now question is by using sister since this uh, particular lecture is uh, concerned with uh, sister channel and the sister. So question is uh, how we can obtain such curves using this sister tools and uh, answer is simple we have one inbuilt uh, tool inside this sister package so this is that sister 4.1 v4 and here in the util directory you can get uh, this vibra this is a tool and this uh, folder containing three more folders one is this doc that is related to the documentation part and one good manual is uh, given therein and uh, if you are interested you can go through this and the second one is uh, the, the some examples uh, and uh, in order to learn this uh, these examples are very uh, useful and then this sub file where we can get uh, you can get uh, the binary files to run this uh, Vibra tool. So compilation of this uh, Vibra tool is very easy. Just you have to use one single command that is make one. And uh, within few seconds, you can get binary files. And one binary file is this FC build. This is, and the second binary file is this Vibra. And uh, you have to use these two binary files. And uh, so I would like to I just recommend that just copy or link this uh, two binary files to your uh, bin directory and uh, method is also very simple in example files you can go through this uh, this is uh, two example two fdo files related to this uh, vibra run one is this fdo four so if you are familiar with uh, FDF files, so all these are the common terms. These are the latest vector. These are the spaces. And uh, one thing is here, uh, this is uh, scale Cartesian uh, terms. And this is a uh, very important term that is the super sale. So you have to make, uh, you have to decide uh, the number of super cells by using this. So, and uh, this is that uh, bend, bend scale, uh, terms and uh, by using that uh, CK path you can get these uh, uh, lines easily and in uh, one of the lectures uh, related to GNU bands and uh, the band formation study uh, I have uh, detailed this uh, particular band line so I'm not going to uh, detail here so this is one file <coughs> second FDF file uh, this is uh, 
again same situation level and uh, this uh, number of species here and that chemical block and some basic information related to sister that may cut off uh, it is here I'm only given that is 130 and uh, uh, one some suggestions we are given in uh, sister l uh, portal or uh, that uh, talk blocks that uh, this miss cut off should be some more um, more than 300 400 so but here just as an example i am taking here or in given in example this is given as 130 are only so now we can run this so we have to use uh, simple um, one command that is uh, fc build and uh, this is the first uh, list of file and this will create the number of super cell so this is uh, so this is the term so uh, here total number of super cell created this is 27 and it is uh, given in this uh, uh, fc dot uh, uh, this file so fc dot fd file this contains 54 items now and this will uh, further use this so the second uh, command we have to use is that is the uh, sister run so that sister command is uh, you know that npi run uh, simple command np with three or i have uh, two nodes so this is uh, now second file that is the sister file i will use here so this copy and uh, It will take some time depending on the speed and number of items. So what is happening? Is there? Oh, main thing I have forgotten that is the sister one. Okay, so. So this will take some uh, more time, and uh, after that you will get one band file, and uh, that band file can be converted in, uh, to data files by using that uh, GNU file. So this is the simple uh, method. So I what I am giving is special here. That is, I am introducing one simple uh, script for uh, this vibrator uh, also because uh, my one uh, my simple objective is uh, to make uh, things easy. So here I am introducing two uh, two scripts uh, because I am introducing two tools to run uh, this phone on. One is uh, this Vibra. Uh, so this is uh, that one is script. So whatever two files. Containing in that example directory, I have just uh, arranged those two files in uh, this uh, this is script. So that the first part is here that that latest vector and uh, all things. So and uh, eigen vectors, everything is here. And the second part that is this is related to that uh, uh, bandit things and uh, uh, this. This is uh, related to the second part and some more things. So, what this uh, particular script will perform? So, first uh, this will create one directory, and then uh, this will create two FDF files, and uh, it will run that FC build Vibra as well as that Sista, and finally uh, this will give one uh, bent plot. So, this everything will be. Automated, so there is no need of worry about uh, uh, giving you different uh, commands in the command window. Just you have to run this, and uh, but before this, uh, you have to assure that that uh, Vibra has been compiled properly, uh, and as well as that you have FC bin and uh, Vibra in bin directory, and, uh, and with this uh, script, uh, you must have that uh, PSF files related to uh, that system under study. So. Let's start this uh, running this script. 
that is just ss command is simple next uh, this will start so and after some time you will get uh, that uh, output file so you have to wait and the second uh, that tool that is that phonopy this is very uh, famous tool and uh, was users and many users this is, are, are using this phonopy uh, to get that uh, phonon dispersion curve this is a purely uh, phonon uh, sorry python based uh, this, this is python based um, tool so also one uh, script i have to just uh, developed uh, using this but before that you have to uh, install this phonopy in your system so that uh, installation is a very straight uh, forward and uh, you can so this is uh, a simple installation instruction how to install this and uh, you can you can have a different uh, youtube uh, help youtube video related to this phonopy installation so uh, by using that simple uh, miniconda and uh, conda commands and uh, you can get uh, uh, this phonopy installed in your system so installation is not uh, a very big task uh, related to uh, this phonopy and anyone uh, using that linux operating system can install this uh, and especially in the world to just google it how to install this uh, and uh, you can install in case of any doubt you can just uh, send me one mail and i can i will help you so so after installation this what you have to do you have to just uh, modify this uh, uh, phonopy script and here again that name system names and other things all these are can be used and i have taken the same uh, example uh, from that viber tool so but here two more their key points are not mentioned here this uh, this is that uh, uh, two key points are there one this this is related to super sale and the uh, one is related to uh, that uh, unit sale so this one is related to unit sale so this is 555 this is 333 okay so one result from viber one so we have this so, so this has been completed and uh, this is that uh, result of that vibra run and you are getting this beautiful uh, curve that is the phonon dispersion curve this is the frequency this is the uh, vector uh, latest vector so uh, and uh, you can interpret this these are that acoustic curves this is that uh, uh, this is a transverse acoustic curves this is a longitudinal acoustic curve and then that optical curve and so uh, in any paper you can actually help and uh, interpret this one so the vibra run is uh, over so in the vibra run just you have to run that uh, script and uh, you can ask uh, for that script and i will obviously uh, give you that script and uh, 10 to 10 you can take my help uh, than that so uh, this actually takes uh, some uh, more uh, computational time depending on uh, that uh, number of items uh, and also that mess cut off and here the same second uh, uh, script i'm introducing here that is related to phonopy so all those informations are here and uh, but remember this this here this latest constant is in bore and there that latest constant was in Restaurant and these are the latest vectors and everything was here and uh, that super sale super sale is uh, mentioned here in uh, dimension from here and that uh, this is that shifting so what you have to change you have to uh, change this uh, super sale and uh, other things and that band lines are given here in, in these points and these are the band lines that zero 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 and uh, that band points is uh, taken as hundred here so you can get uh, that result so again here the method is simple what you have to do you have to modify that this is script recording to your system 
and uh, run by using a simple command that is the same one as its command and uh, this will if everything is uh, good this will start uh, working so here i would like to mention depending on the nature of your um, material that number of super sale uh, just uh, created by this phonopy uh, is maybe much more and here only single super sale uh, is created by this phonopy because this system is a very stable system and a good one and uh, uh, i have another example that is easy trial and i have uh, used this phonopy and that's the miss cut off effect i have observed here so here it has, it has been a, it is a, this phonopy has created three super cells so uh, three folders uh, are created by using this script and uh, individually sister run will perform and that four sets are there and finally uh, that uh, band file uh, band config file uh, it is created and uh, uh, by using this uh, for a pi script you can get that final bench structure so the variables are first what you have to do what the variables are uh, first you have to uh, modify that uh, uh, script depending on uh, your particular system and then here then sequence here just i have taken 111 one, and you have to modify this according to your numbers of uh, super cells created by this phonopy if that numbers of super cells created is 5 to 6 uh, 5 6 7 that 0 0 1 0 0 2 0 0 3 and so on then here uh, you have to change that starting from 0 0 1 to in the gate of 1 to uh, 8 5 depending on types and uh, next uh, modification that uh, bend lines Bend lines you have to uh, write here. You have to modify here depending on your system. And this uh, the dimension means the number of supercell that is three 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 four 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 two two two. Uh, you have to modify. And these are the, the terms related to uh, related to that in your system. The difference between this uh, phonon and uh, this phonopi is in case of phonon uh, here you have to mention that. Uh, atomic mass of that uh, material in the, but in the phonopy there is no need of that atomic mass but here in uh, uh, the lattice vector this is in bore but uh, here this is not in bore just uh, uh, you have to take this scale uh, position and uh, mostly uh, the, frac uh, the fractional part is taken by this uh, uh, phonopy but other parameters are same and this uh, one, 150 or why i have taken that 130 uh, there and s j this is s j here system level is same so everything is same and uh, if you want to get good result then the systematic study is very important so you can uh, have two variables one is uh, uh, the uh, mass cutoff so you can start from 150 150 to uh, 600 and i get uh, i have uh, checked this uh, these two scripts uh, by using uh, different mass cutoffs is starting from 150 to uh, about 600 and get good result more than 400 are white uh, so uh, you can take that as a default value also but if you want to take systematic study then you should vary this uh, uh, mass cutoff is starting from 150 to that and uh, uh, for lower mass cutoff you will uh, save some uh, computational time and second also the number of items if the number of items in uh, overall uh, super cells it's more than 200 then the result will be good otherwise uh, you can get uh, you can uh, run that system uh, containing 100 items more than 100 items also so you have to take uh, this uh, uh, you have to, so by using these two variables you can uh, run this phonon and uh, you can get uh, uh, good curves so i think uh, Taking, uh, yeah, this one, this will be, this will give uh, that result. So we are waiting here. So some points, what uh, I would like to mention here, 
what you have to do first you have to make a one uh, simple uh, simple sale and then uh, you have to optimize that obviously optimized uh, structure you have to take you have to take uh, don't take that rough data from that uh, uh, materials project or other um, uh, tools just uh, take that system and a uh, simple uh, sale you have to take and uh, uh, optimize that system by using that um, method of optimization we have three uh, steps optimization method and uh, after optimization take that optimized uh, coordinates here in this uh, blocks and uh, by using uh, proper numbers of super cells you have to run either vibra by using this uh, one and uh, that uh, phonopy by using this and uh, you can get uh, uh, good result this is uh, so let us write some more time just taking 27 universals are there This is another file, and uh, I have just uh, optimized this uh, unit cell uh, by using this cutoff lattice optimization and phonopy and vibra is also there. And uh, mesh cutoff variation, just I have uh, this mesh cutoff variation. And, uh, this is uh, that bent file. So, after running this, if you want to plot this bend, then this is used, and the command is simple. That Uno pi uh, sp and uh, bend dot f. So this is that dispersion curve for that silver. So wonderful dispersion curve and uh, that numbers of optical uh, lines. This depends on the uh, total number of uh, atoms available in. Uh, that in itself so that number of atoms are much more than uh, obviously there will be some dense lines in uh, this curve so and also supercell effect i have observed for example 111 uh, in case of this 111 means base number of uh, atoms uh, then uh, i will have that uh, followed by this p uh, and uh, yeah so here this is that band and uh, there is some negative frequency and uh, there are many problems facing by many such that they are they are getting negative frequencies so the answer is simple this negative frequency uh, getting in this uh, uh, curve is Either that is that may be that may be the characteristics if that the system is uh, dynamic, dynamically unstable, but uh, many times it may be uh, because of this less numbers of uh, atoms taken under study. So take the total number of supercell in such a way that total number of uh, atoms uh, in maybe more than 200, and you will get a good result. So 111 means uh, we are just uh, uh, using uh, how many atoms here only. Three atoms are there. Okay, three atoms are there. So the result means we stop and three, three, three. We have eighty-one atoms. So comparatively, you will get you will get a uh, you know, good result. So this is the term in the. Uh, okay, so I think uh, this is. Uh, enough and uh, i should include here and uh, yeah this one it is now it is generated by uh, that uh, a script i have started and, uh, this is for that listen so this is related to phonopy and uh, first one was uh, related to so 
So. Okay. So let's let me conclude. So the vibra, I have taken this. So it, it this um, this particular script created one folder, and this folders that total. Uh, the, these two uh, FDF files were generated, bands file were generated and uh, after this bands file is converted into data file and the total plot uh, you can get uh, you can obtain. So add some grace start out to date. This is the date file. The, this is that band plot uh, related to This is from the Vibra and for, from Phonopy. Um, is that so? One is slightly different. Phonopy, and you can learn the command. Yeah, this is that one. So we have this is the curve related to Vibra. This is related to Phonify. So both are wonderful methods, and uh, but different. I am not getting what the reason is. Uh, uh, the numbers of uh, the frequency values in case of Vibra is more than that frequency value uh, given by this Phonify. So this Phonify is also good tool, and uh, you can choose any of. Uh, both are reliable. Okay, so. Thank you all. And uh, give me the feedback as well as if you want to have this uh, script, then just mail me. And sometimes I missed some mail, then just remind me also. So thank you all.